Alright, today I'm going to be doing some figures. I did have a little bit of a break because because I needed it. Um, so don't feel you have to do these every single day because you because you don't. You do them as you need to do them. You, do, you don't want to make it a chore. So we want it to keep it fun, to keep it light. And because it's been a couple of days, I'm going to be doing the figures, as I said. So we'll do... I'll pop my reference up on the screen and I'm just trying to think. I did have some trouble trying to find some references this morning because I wanted a mix of male and female, but the male poses are really, really hard to find because a lot of them are just sort of standing really stiff. It's like their, you know, muscles are just too tightly wound or something rather they're not as flexible and as, you know, feline as what um, women poses are. So... I did have a bit of trouble with that, but I have found a few. However, I am going to start with uh, the male lunging pose. I'm going to do five minutes each and see how we go. We'll start now. There we go. All right, so let's get to it. I probably should have brought my glasses, but that's fine. I don't really need to see, I guess. So... Because it's been a couple of days, I'm, I'm expecting this to be quite rough. Not, I mean, my, most of my drawings are rough anyway, but <laughs> my sketches, that is. But yeah, I took a break from doing anything art related. Because I just felt that, that I needed it. Because I have filled my life with it, and I am so glad to have art in my life. But sometimes you just need to have a bit of a break. And that's, that's what I did. So I'm just reducing, because that's been a while, I'm just reducing things to just simple lines to see how we go. So my original lines are, aren't accurate, but that's fine. Because we need to get marks down on the paper first sometimes before we know, you know, how do we know where we're going wrong if we don't put, put something down. All right, I can see I'm, I'm making a big mistake here. So I'm just going to see if I can fix it this way. All right. The problem of things growing, <laughs> they always grow. I never seem to shrink them, but I always have no trouble making them bigger. So I'm just doing that foot shape where the front is, is wider. And that will do. I think this heel will go here. I might just put a triangle for the heel. That will do. Well, it's not too bad. I mean, it's not not as flowy as gestural as I probably would have liked, but but that's fine. Like I said, it's been a few days. Just going to group all the fingers together. Simple shapes to start. This is going forwards, so we use our spirals. I think that will do for that. We've got a minute and a half left. There we go. <laughs> to go straight up from here to the ear. And 
and for the shape of the face, I think I'll just do the face plate. You would have seen me do this before. Where I don't actually draw the face in, I just do a plate, face plate where it would go. And the hair. And then if we've got time, we can go back and put some, some lines over where we've, where we've been. Practicing holding our pencil the way we want. There we go. That's our first one. Choose the second one. So we'll go for a female pose and I think I'll just fit this, this one in. I'll put it up on the screen and we'll start straight away. Let's go. Now this is only um, a three quarter so I'll try. Because I find that things are growing, I'm going to try. I just put very, very basic shapes. Stack them. And this is where I want it to end. So let's see if we can turn that into a person. I'm going to do, I've got another video planned soon where I'm going to do some line drawings because I do find them fun because you can't mess up. So the reason why I want to do the blind drawing soon is because I want to, I want to enjoy that with, with the people that watch my videos, basically. <laughs> because I think, I think we can all get something out of that. All right, so this is difficult because she is really twisted. So this is the side of the body and this is the back. So let's just indicate that. And then we can make our corrections along the way. We're getting there, we're getting there. So I'm just doing a corner. Basic triangle, well, curvy triangle. I'll just do some marks for the, um, what do you call the laces? Right, so this is part of the buttocks and where the thigh joins. So we'll just put that there. Do the same for here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I've given this lady a bit of a big butt, but that's fine. It's part of the fun, isn't it? We'll just shade this in so we know what that is. Need to get going because I've only got a minute and a little bit left. So let's see what we can do here. Just 
just drawing the edge with a wandering little curly line. Does it matter? I think that will do for the face. I did make her thighs a little bit wider than probably what she would she would like. But no, uh, you know, whatever. Remember dark to light, dark to light, and we're done. So that's number two. Definitely rusty, but that's that's fine. I'm okay with that. Now let's see which pose next. I think I'll do four today, so this will be four 20 minute um session so we'll go with the next one I'll put it up on the screen now this is a, a bit of an active pose I'm going to try and draw smaller so I do have a problem with them getting bigger as I draw them so I think stacking shapes figuring out the top and the bottom and halfway top bottom halfway about there right Oh gosh, this is this is I've just made it 100 times harder. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to do this. All right. Let's just let's just do whatever we can. Not going to be perfect. Definitely not going to be perfect. Right. Got a hand here, and a hand going out here. Let's see what we can do with that. Okay, so I've shrunk. I think I've shrunk his. Okay, <laughs> I'm trying to, and this is part of the fun of sketching as well. When you when you're actually trying to figure something out, I actually find that quite fun. It doesn't always work out, but you're using, you know, you're using your brain. I can tell that this man's body does not fit. <laughs> Maybe down here. And this is the thing. This is this is my particular problem of of. Um, Of my drawings growing as I draw them. Okay. All right. Very rudimentary. Well, you can see how rough my marks are, and I'm not being accurate. I think I've run out of room for the other foot. That's fine. All right, let's. Uh, oh, 
Rough, very rough. Sometimes it's handy just to put these little things in the armpits because then you've got somewhere to go from underneath the arm. So this is going this way. And it's still going. I think that's still going back. Dark to light. And we're done. That's three. Uh, well, it's what it is. <laughs> All right. Um, let's see for the next one. I'm gonna. I think I am going to try for this other gentleman that's laying laying down or sitting down, and we'll see how that goes. So we'll start now. Um, all right, let's see if I can just do an envelope for the whole thing. Drawing the negative space. Sometimes it does help to draw the negative spaces. You just imagine them as a shape on their own. I'm sure I'll have to go back and count those toes later. Next coming out of here, I would say. Now this head is at an angle, so I'm just gonna try and indicate outside and see how that goes. Ooh, something's off there. <laughs> I can already tell. Alright, let's let's break it down even further. We'll just do the outside of the head. That's helping a little bit. Helps us to see. Chest is going this way. We've got that little mark. And that gives us the space down in here so we can go dark to light. Just 
Wearing clothes can sometimes be challenging too, as you can see. So I'm not going to draw all of it. But see, something's gone wrong here because already this leg needs to grow. So it's a work in progress. And this is the thing, a lot of, a lot of the things that you'll be working on in your sketches are things that you'll have to work on over time because it's not going to just fix straight away. You're not going to get it straight away. It will take time because it's a way of seeing. And obviously I can't without, I mean, I can do it if I measure, but these are sketches and I don't, I don't want to measure my sketches. I just want them to be free. So I can already tell that, that I've not left enough room for the, for the leg because this knee should be, this thigh would be here. So the rest of it would be down, down here. There's not really room for the foot, less than a minute. So I'm just gonna see what I can do. Oh, I hate that noise. polystyrene. Can't stand polystyrene. It's like chalk. It's too dry. <laughs> it's terrible. Just put his nipples in. All right. Dark to light. Oh gosh. Can we, can we fit this arm in? No, nope, that's all we're going to get. That's it. So that's our four for today. And today's the 22nd of December 23 because I had a few days off. I'll probably have a few more days off before Christmas. So um, just be prepared for that. And I will see you next time. Keep drawing everyone.